this is WCYT, and this is our evening's performance of Jack and the Beanstalk, brought to you by the CYT players. And now, Jack and the Beanstalk. Once upon a time, there was a boy named Jack. He lived with his mother. Jack and his mother lived on a farm. Actually, it was a very small farm. They only had one cow. Moo. And every morning, <coughs> while he was trying his best to sleep late, he would hear, Jack. Yes, mother? It's time to milk the cow. Yes, mother. So he did. Jack? Yes, mother? Take the milk to the market. Yes, mother. Every day, Jack took the milk to sell at the market. Now, at the time our story takes place, in the place where our story takes place, conditions were harsh. There was a drought, no rain, and famine, no food, and general malaise, no fun. The crops were not plentiful, and the animals were not fat and healthy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Jack, it's time to milk the cow. Jack wants to milk the cow, but she was not fat and healthy, and she gave very little milk. Meh. Jack? Yes, mother? It's time to sell the cow. Take her to market and see that you get no less than five pounds for her. If so, Jack took the cow to the market. Along the way, saw a stranger walking towards him. The stranger walked with a limp and then became. Hello there, Jack said the stranger. Where are you going with that cow? My mother says I'm a seller at the market for no more than, oh, that's not right, no less than five pounds. She does not look so well. Meh. <laughs> I know, I'm afraid she's not worth much money. I'll give you something for her. You will? Not more than... Oh, I mean, not less than five pounds. Oh, something worth a lot more. The stranger opened his hand and showed Jack. Magic beans. Beans. Magic beans. <laughs> The stranger reached into his pocket and pulled out five large beans. He gave the beans to Jack, then took the cow's robe and, put, and led her away. Meh. And Jack ran home to his mother. Mother, look. See what I got for the cow. Magic beans. Beans? These aren't just any beans, Mother. They're magic. Before he could finish, Jack's mother snatched the beans out of his hand and threw them out of the window. <laughs> the hard, dry ground. Night fell. Then rain fell. And those beans began to grow. They grew and grew and grew. And in the morning, Jack woke up to find a giant beanstalk growing right outside his window. Whoa. Now, Jack just naturally wanted to climb that beanstalk. So he climbed, and he climbed, and he climbed, until he the top. Phew. When he got there, he could hear a sound, a very large sound. It was coming from a very large house. Jack tiptoed up to the house. Shh. He looked inside and he saw a giant! Boy. 
Jack wanted that silver. He opened the window. He crept up towards the table. He tripped. Oh no. He fell and woke the giant. Be fi fo fum. The giant hated to be awakened from his nap and he pounded on the table. Spilling silver coins all over the floor. Jack scooped up the silver and started to run. And the giant came running after him. He ran back to the beast. Thank you for joining us on WCYT.